We are learning more tonight about people who get bilked out of thousands of dollars after they buy a car with a fake VIN plate. Fox 5's Joe V is here with how big the problem is getting and what you can do about it. Yeah, that's right. So many of you have been hit hard by rising car insurance rates, and I'm working on a story right now about skyrocketing rates. And while researching this issue, we found some interesting information on how big VIN switching is becoming for thieves. So first of all, this is how VIN switching works. The thief steals a car, finds a VIN plate similar to the model stolen. They attach that phony plate to the stolen car and sell that car to an unsuspecting buyer. When that person goes to register the car, they find out the hard way the car is stolen. You will then lose the car and the money that you paid for it. Now, last fall, the Nevada Division of Insurance held a webinar about rising car insurance rates. A lead official with Nevada's Department of Motor Vehicles said something a little surprising about a link to cartels. It's so profitable, in fact, that we, we can tie cartel activity to this behavior. Um, you know, it's profitable if the drug cartels are diverting their attention away from that, that uh, occupation to steal cars and then switch them. So once again, that came from the Nevada Division of Insurance webinar. So how do you prevent this? If you're buying a car from someone, get a VIN inspection at a Nevada DMV inspection station before the money changes hands. That inspection will determine if the car that you want to buy from someone is stolen. And stay tuned for my special report on rising car insurance rates in the near future. For now, back to you.